launching a meme coin on PanFan is really easy, but make it succeed is not that easy. That's why you are here, because you want to know how to make it pump, how to pump your token and make it complete the bonding curve. Don't worry, I got you covered. I will show you the best volume bot you can find right now on Solana for your PanFan token. Let's go directly on how to use it and how to pump your token to the moon. For boosting the volume of our token, we are going to use these tools you are seeing here, okay? Smithy Tools is a no-code tool suite where you can create, launch, manage, make everything related to a token in Solana, on PanFan, on Radium, etc. And here on PanFan Zone, we can find our PanFan Market Maker, where we can boost the token, volume and makers, run bumps, or use an advanced options where we can make a custom strategy to pump our token. In this case, I'm going to show you the boost token, which is the most simple one. And you can explore the other ones if you want to. I don't have a token launch on PanFan right now. So let me just pick one from here. I just came to the screener. This is PanFan. Okay, let's just pick a new one. In this case, I'm going to just grab a random one from here. Uh, for example, Mu, Festico. I don't know. <laughs> and... I'm gonna copy the token address. Here we have it. We come back to Panfa Market Maker. You will have the link in the description, okay? And we can paste the token address here. Then we just need to uh, select how much makers we want. It means how much wallets we want to buy and sell our token and how much volume we want. Basically, how much volume we wanna generate in our token as well. Based on these parameters, we will know how much we want to spend and how much time we want to run the bot. Okay, if you want to exactly put the amounts you want to make it show on PanFam correctly in the trades, etc., you can come to Advanced Bot and select the order amount and the time between every transaction. Okay, in this case, I will just run the default um, settings because it's just a test. Uh, let's uh, follow up the token here once I start the bot, okay? So the fee of the tool itself is 0 0.025 sold each 100 makers, okay? And uh, we need to take an account that we will be spending Solana in gas fees. So this is the total spend uh, of the tool fee plus the Solana we will need to spend on transaction fees. So now everything is ready. We just need to click on start bot, confirm the payment transaction. And now success, bot started successfully. To follow up, to check what's happening, we can come here and we will see the logs, okay? In case you wanna run several volume bots at the same time and you wanna track each one of them, you can just open a new tab in another browser and you can follow both of them at the same time because if you run another new bot, you will just see the last run here in the logs okay so let it load a bit it takes around 30 seconds one minute to start making the transactions because what will happen is we will send the money to a wallet that will with create makers and will distribute the money to different makers and there will be buying and selling or token the whole time okay as we can see now it's starting maker one after 30 seconds and Mark Maker One funded. This is the wallet of the first wallet. Uh, this is the address of the first wallet that will buy and sell our token. Okay, let me open it on SolScan so we can track what is happening. As you can see, the Sol is this. Let's see all the transactions. What, what happened is this wallet, which is the distribution wallet, sent money to this maker. It made a trade on PanFan. As you can see, both the tokens and now it should be selling these tokens, Mu. So if we come here, we will be seeing a lot of small transactions coming, which are uh, these ones. Uh, for example, in this account ends on, this account ends on ZK8L, which is this one. And as we can see here, this wallet buys and here sells. It's happening the same with all these wallets and we can track everything from here. 
Maker 1, Maker 2, Maker 3, and it's showing us what's happening. The sell swap, the buy swap, etc. And the time for each one. Basically, based on how much makers, etc., you select, it will take more or less time. It's kind of random the amount of tokens the makers are buying and how long they take to buy and sell in order to make it look much more organic. This is really important because if the bot looks as a bot, people won't trust that it's organic and people won't be entering into the token. But as you can see, the bot keeps buying until those 30 minutes we have. Um, for buying and selling the, the token and boosting the volume and the makers of our token. One really important thing is that this also help us trending on PanFan, on the screener, Photon and all trading bots and platforms. Why? Because these platforms take on account the amount of volume and makers you have. Plus, if you are having transactions all the time, you will be appearing on the homepage of PanFan the whole time. This is really important because it gives exposure to your token and also your token looks much more alive for those who are seeing the token and will want to get in and buy. If you want to learn how to exactly trend on the screen and these kind of trading platforms, here you have a video on how to do that. But it's really important that you run these bots in order to succeed. It's actually the meta and you need it to, to make your token succeed and make it happen, basically. So that's it. Now you know the best volume bot available on Solana and you can pump your token PumpFan. It also works on PumpSwap and some other DEXs. So if you have tokens in several launchpads, you can use it as well. But anyway, that's it for today. Thank you so much for watching and see you in the next one. Bye. -bye.